the roots of monocots and young dicots are similar in that there is an outer epidermis, a cortex, an inner endodermis, an area known as the pericycle interior to the endodermis, bundles of xylem vessels, and bundles of phloem sieve tubes near the xylem. In monocots, these vascular bundles are arranged in a circular arrangement, while in dicots, the xylem forms a central X-shaped formation. In dicots, the pericycle and the parenchyma around the vascular fibers can form a root vascular cambium, a lateral meristem which will then allow secondary growth, and the new xylem and phloem added as secondary xylem and secondary phloem will then crush these primary tissues and allow the roots to become wider. This only occurs in the roots of dicots.